Hey guys, what's going on? It's Nark. Welcome along to a brand new video. Today we're going to be playing Five Shades of Cube by Wild Drew and ESPF. This is a large map with a few different areas and elements. I've been kind of, I've been kind, and there are a few save points in the map. There's also a six. A medium level with a tricky area. When it comes to it, jump into the hole. It'll help. Okay. I uh, hope you enjoy it. Leave feedback. Thanks, Wild Drew. To those who would vote this level down, this level can be completed. All right, so obviously getting some negative review, but let's jump into the map and see what we've got. Five Shades of Cube. Yeah, just uh, getting a, a test ready for you, obviously. Who else would I be doing it for? No one. Although, some lazy. Idea. What if we stand here and let the gentle hum of the laser transport us to a state of absolute relaxation? Might help us think of a way to open the door. Just do the test. Just do the test. Okay, we can jump across there. Just wanted to check. All right, so. Not a lot going on here at the moment. Uh, actually, there may be. How about we do this and this? And then we're going to fling ourselves across to there. Let's try, like, here perhaps. If I can do this. Really? Come on, game. Yep, we got across here. Excellent. So, that opens up this bit. Oh, there's two things here. Okay, so that doesn't really help at the moment until we can get a until we get an extra safety cube in here that doesn't help okay so let's go into two perhaps yeah that probably that probably would help and we've got a laser puzzle with three redirection cubes Okay. Okay, so let's think about another way to do this. I wouldn't say I'm the best at redirection puzzles, but I'm certainly a lot better than I used to be. And then we take this one and plop this one, I don't know, say there, for instance. And what's that done? It's activated something. And we can't take any cubes out with us. Which is fine. Again, though, we don't need to do that because we can get across there without doing that. But uh, you know, let's, let's take the the easy way, shall we? This time. Yeah, I mean, we still need to get that back, right? No bother. Aha! This is where we need to proceed. So I saw like an open door, which was quite bizarre, and I couldn't comprehend why. Okay. No 
I'll take the cube over to the other side. Obviously there's no way back for the sphere, so we won't even bother trying to take it. That'd be pointless. Not sure if we need that just yet, but we'll leave that there. Oh, okay, we can't go back over there. Trigger is disabling that. I hear a... A walkie thingy somewhere. Okay. Now, if I remember rightly, these can't walk on grates, can they? So there's no point in trying to... Get it to do that. Is that on a timer? Or is that permanent? That much I don't know. So. I think what we'll do is we'll go down to here. Yeah, we'll jump down first, or else we're going to have far too much velocity, right? Okay. So maybe we need to jump into... Still not going to make it. Hmm. <laughs> okay. Let's then instead go and see what this does, shall we? Might help. I think it's going to start the bounce jar, right? Yeah. It starts the bounce jar. Okay. So, then we're going to do. What do we need the funnel for, though? Our funnel takes us back to the exit. Okay. So that's too much. Oh, I did get some there. That's weird. Okay. I wonder if Doesn't really. Ah, hold on. That's what I think I need to do. Okay. Let's try this again. Nope. On. Maybe I need to jump again. There we go. Sweet. Now, 
I mean, the other thing I probably could have done... I could have bounced off there, because you can bounce off a um, Franken cube, can't you? That may have also worked. Okay. Now this should give me... Second cube, which thankfully auto respawns. And then we can go over here. I want to test that theory. I want to test a theory out. So, save. Because there's no other reason for it to be a Frank a Franken cube. There is no other reason at all. So, Yeah, yeah. That's what you're meant to do. Not meant to use the ledge, although I used it. You're meant to use the Franken. There was no other way, or no other point or purpose for that being there until I just thought about it then. So, <coughs> yeah. I think that's the intended. So, that is us done. And that's probably why so many people are being negative in the um, and giving you thumbs downs, Drew. Um, oh, sorry. Well, I'm being a total noob here. Um, it would really help if you could have like an introduction room or something, which would um, sort of um, display that in some sort of way or make some sort of ju jump where the Franken Cube is covered in gel and as it, maybe it, like come out of a portal. That you fall on the Franken cube and then you propel yourself further on, and I think that would uh, cure a lot of the problem. I think people just don't appreciate and don't understand, or don't know even that you can actually bounce off a Franken cube and it won't like bounce around. So, um, but yeah, other than that, good map. Um, not too long, nice and short. So uh, I'll give you a thumbs up. Thank you very much, guys. As always, like, comment, subscribe down below. If you've got the match light to play, please leave them down below in the comments or head over to my Discord. You'll find a link to that in the description where you'll find my map suggestions channel. But until next time, I've been Knock. You've been awesome. Happy gaming.